Hello everyone. I am Aishwarya N. Bableshwar, the student of 3rd SEM BCA, studying in KLE Society's College of BCA, Goka. Today, we are going to learn about the features of Java. Java is a high-level, object-oriented programming language. Originally, Java was developed by Sun Microsystems, which was initiated by James Gosling and released in 1995. We can define Java as a programming language as we can write the codes and run applications in it and we can also define it as platform. The most important property that is JRE that is Java runtime environment here are the features of java compiled and interpreted platform independent and portable object oriented robust and secure distributed familiar simple and small multi-threaded and interactive high performance dynamic and extensible now let's see the features of Java one by one in detail. The first one that is compiled and interpreted. Java uses both the compiler and the interpreter. Usually a compiler converts this, the code into, into the machine code. Here the Java compiler converts the Java source code. into byte code which is also called as intermediate code and then there is an interpreter that converts the byte code into machine code which is also called as the object code. Therefore, Java is called compiled and interpreted. The next feature that is platform independent and portable. Java uses the byte code concept that is an intermediate code. That code can run any on any machine and it supports all the systems. That is write once and run anywhere. The byte code concept is the most important here and this is the most important feature of Java. It, the Java has its own plat platform and there are two parts that is JRE and API. JRE is Java Runtime Environment and API is Application Programmable Interface. So here the Java source code is converted into byte code using a compiler. It is portable. Like if suppose you write a program, a Java program on Windows or operating system and you compile it and you get the byte code. Now this byte code, you can run this program on any other operating system. Uh, for example, if you, if you run this byte code on Mac operating system, it is possible because of the installed JVM that is Java Virtual Machine. Therefore, the, j therefore, the program that is written on any other operating system can be run on other operating system. You can write once and run anywhere. Therefore, Java is platform independent and portable. The next one is object oriented. All the entities or elements that in Java are considered as object. It is an object oriented programming language. Java implements the com concepts of OOPS that is such as encapsulation, inheritance, polymorphism etc. You can also create the object and class in Java. Therefore it is object oriented programming language. The next feature is distributed. 
Java is used to create a distributed software system which has the ability to share data and programs. The next one is familiar, simple and small. Sim this, this language that is Java is simple language to use. It is familiar and also small compared to C and C++. The syntax are based on C++ and it also doesn't have the concept of pointers. It doesn't have the concept of pointers which makes it more simple to learn. The next feature is robust and secure. It is robust due to two reasons. Due to the automatic garbage collection that is you you don't have to worry about the memory allocation and another reason is the strong exception handling it is reliable and it also provides safety to be reliable on the given code and even provides security of the data and applications that are on the internet the next feature is multi-threaded and interactive Suppose a program, there is a program that is divided into several smaller parts and each of this part is called thread. Each part runs simultaneously and these parts communicate with each other. Thus they are interactive. The next feature is high, perf high performance. It is high performance programming language compared to C and C++ because Java uses the concept of byte code. Java uses less runtime as compared to C and C++, thus providing high performance. The next feature is dynamic and extensible. It is dynamic language and has the ability to link any new library to the Java program if it is required during the runtime. We can also extend the Java program by adding the new features. So these are the features of Java. Thank you.